Hi, I'm Alexandra and today I'm on Xiaopafang in Xiyuan Middle Road. Uh, before it used to be Pajie Chao old residential area, but now it has been renovated and transformed into Wenzhou's first musical creative district. If you haven't been here before, please hurry up and keep up with me. Have you seen those red installations over there? They are amazing. The Making Voice art exhibition is being held here. Xiao Pa Fang holds four art exhibitions with different themes every year and they are all three. So what's this? Uh, it reminds me a fireball during the music festival. Do these triangles and red lines represent the beating sound waves? Installation art is always hard to explain in words, but I do feel its vivid emotions. The bricks and tiles here are flowing with the code that could unlock the cultural genes of Wenzhou. It has the real Wenzhou characteristics. It is hard to imagine that a place demolished and reconstructed from old residential buildings could finally become the current downtown Shangri-La. Possessing the natural geographical advantage of Wenzhui Canal and inheriting the giant ambience of Wenzhou's ancient lanes, it is releasing a new artistic vitality. Night comes to Xiaopafang, the fresh breeze, um, is blowing slightly and there are a lot of interesting people are coming and going. During the daytime, Xiao Pai Fang looks like a lazy cat laying on an ancient wall and during the nightlife it opens his eyes where you can watch the nightlife passing by. Come on and let's check it out! Very beautiful. I like it. Music, art performances, food, good wine and tea. What you see are not only shops, but a new way of life Xiao Pa Fang is representing. No wonder it becomes a new fashionable landmark for Wenzhou's young people. Now I'm going home and I'm looking forward to meet you at Xiao Pa Fang next time. <laughs>